Good evening, YouTube, and everybody watching. I am Unfortunate Witness X, and this is my video for today. Like almost all people, I like to watch YouTube videos, but like a lot of people, I feel inspired to make my own YouTube videos, like this one today. So why am I making this one tonight, late at night, on such a short notice? Because I came across an issue, not a bad issue, but a wonderful tool that I can't wait to share on the new year. No, this has to be heard right now. I will call it the Snowflake tool. Why Snowflake? Well, YouTube actually didn't get called it that. It's not on the block. But, when you click on the tool with this symbol, Snowflake comes at the top of the screen, right to the bottom, and it stays on the and pile up. But, here's the cool part. When you move the cursor left or right, some of the Snowflakes will move in that direction where you move the cursor. And that's what makes it like Christmas with some of the videos. With this icon. Now, by the time this video is posted, if you see the symbol on this screen, what well, at the bottom of this screen here, click on it. But if you don't, I will have a link to another video that has this icon right here. Why? Because this is going to be an impromptu tutorial on how to use the Snowflake tool. Now, you can click on the Snowflake tool um, when the video is playing. Or when you pause it. Either way, when you click on this icon, snow begins to fall. Mm -hmm. Now, you either click on this icon at the bottom of this screen, right here, or click on the link to practice. Alright. Now, for this link, wait at least about two to three minutes to load. So, so click on the play button to let it load for three minutes and click play. Alright? Okay. Whether you like this video or the other video that I provide, click on this link. Now. Now then. Okay. See the snow fix sword falling? Move the cursor to the right. Ah, you will see snowflakes moving to the right and coming out of the left. Now, move the right. Move the right. Yes. See, see the house. See the snowflakes coming from the other one. From the other way. Other side. Yeah. Yeah. Good. You see the snow being piling up. Uh, it means it's like piling up on the street. It is no different than the real snow falling on the ground. Going up into the yard, on the street, waiting to be cleared up. <laughs> now then, here's the, here's the final thing. Okay? Just click on the icon here again and do you see it snow? No? Because when you, when you do it again, it disappears. <sighs> okay. Now pause this video now and wait for one minute and then in the meantime in that one minute click on the icon. Right now. Wow, now that's a lot of snow. 
Oh, so far. Good evening, I come here. Now, the way I see it, it you can e either click it when the video is playing or when you click pause. Either way. Either way. The snow will start to fall when you click on it once. And then instantly, just like that, when you click it again, it will go. I thought that would help a lot of people in case they see this on the screen here. Never mind that it's not perfect, my speech is kind of jumbled up. But I hope that you listen carefully and closely about this too. So, from today, if you ever see this too, with this symbol, this side of the screen, this part, this part of the screen. Click on it and see the snow. Enjoy it all. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I hope to bring it next year because something tells me it won't be here for long. But I hope to bring it next year because it's a fun tool. And we Christmas and reminds everybody Christmas for the rest of their lives. Oh, one more thing. YouTube, if you are watching this, please bring back the zoo next year, Christmas. In fact, bring it every year. Why? Because it will remind people of Christmas in December or even in September or the moment you put that tool in they will be reminded of Christmas all year long. Thank you.